Five minutes later, still can't find my sandal. I've dug through almost the whole dune. And, oh. Well, nature took something back for that rock I took earlier. Trailbenders Overland is presented by Stockham Media and supporting sponsor, The Waterport. It's a bittersweet feeling packing up the last camp of a trip. While we get to go home to our friends and family, it also marks the end of an adventure we had been so excited for. We have just a few stops to make on our final leg of the trip before returning home and beginning plans for the next one. Man, I slept well, but boy, am I tired. I'm really tired. We're somewhere near Blythe. That's all I know. Let's go check out the water. Let's go check out the water. Let's do it. Let's go. California, Arizona. I'm so happy cause today found my friend in my head. What are we doing, Mike? Uh, looking for my time. What are you doing, Mike? Hey, hey, good morning. Good morning. Picking up some burgers here. For breakfast. For burgers for breakfast. We ran out of eggs and it's the last day and it's, we're not going shopping for more eggs. But I mean, you know, can't complain. Burgers are still delicious, so. I think it's a good way to start off the day. Some protein. And then if the water looks nice, we'll go for a swim. Jump into the Colorado oh. River. Oh yeah. That was a good burger. Right? Hit the spot, and Dylan's not wasting any time. He wants to jump right yep. in the water. Yep, we're going, we're going to the water. So, okay. Let's do it. I want to go take a dip. Mm. We're just trying to find a way into the water. We are, and there isn't really anywhere to enter safely. So. It's like either intense marsh or like a five foot drop into it. We wouldn't be able to get back out of that. Something's burning over there. Something's burning. But hey. I hope it's nothing serious. Here we have Arizona on your right and California on your left. Whoa! Very reminiscent of walking down the hill in Death Valley. <laughs> Bill. <laughs> Ow. Guess I'm going nowhere to go but down. Slop, slippy, slidey. All right. Well, I made it. I made it down. I, I made it, Michael. And I'm taking the easier route. I mean, we'll see. Ow. Hope I didn't. Like, put a hole in my shorts. Alright, this, is, this isn't the most steady rock wall. Right? It's very, like, easily. <laughs> yeah, this sucks. Whose yeah, idea was this? But we made it. We're good. Yeah, it's all right. And it's quite a strong current, as you can tell. Oh. Is it gonna be all nasty? Ew! Grouse! 
Oh, but the water is so nice. Whoa, okay, do. Whoa! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, that's freaking strong. Look at that. <laughs> Woo! I'm gonna hang out right here on this rock because that water ain't easy. I'm making freaking waves. It's pushing it on me. I'm just, I just, I just wanted to bathe. Hey. Hey. I'm getting it. Oh my god, come back. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't realize you were that far, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no. like, bro, don't just hang out. <sighs> oh, okay. Yeah, but you better test the rock before you put your way out. You can have that sound a second. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm gonna jump in here. That that boat got to the boat got to go a little bit faster than you do. Just a little bit. Yeah. Get right there, buddy. <laughs> Crikey. So I'm not exactly sure what happened here, but we pulled up last night and the tent cover is like shredded. Um, my guess is there maybe was a smaller cut in it and started flopping in the wind. One cut turned into a bigger cut and then that. So definitely got to make a new cover for the tent. Um, I'm going to put a couple extra straps around it, a net around it, um, just to help keep it safe while we're driving. And, uh, I guess get to work as soon as I get home. At least the tent cover waited for the last day of the trip to rip itself apart. First stop today will be the great sand dunes of Glamis in Southern California. We won't be heading out into the dunes since we're alone in one truck, but neither Michael or I have been there before. It should still be awesome. could dig. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's probably hard to see. The sand is really hot. Yeah, it is. Oh my gosh. Ow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ow! It's really hot. <laughs> Almost lost my sandals there. All right, gonna run down this dune. Here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's hot. Where'd it go? <laughs> I lost my sandal. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> I told him not to lose his handles. Where'd it go? <laughs> Throw the other one out into the flat. <laughs> you can't leave it. <laughs> Good luck getting back up. <laughs> Five minutes later, still can't find my sandal. I've dug through almost the whole dune 
and oh. well nature took something back for that rock I took earlier it has been taken without any proof because you can't even really see our tracks ready charge <laughs> That's a workout. That was gnarly. Yeah. It's like climbing twice what it is. Run, Forrest. Don't lose your sandals. Run, Michael! Well, Michael, <laughs> how'd that go? <laughs> You're dripping like this. Don't lose your sandals if you ever come to Glamis. The dunes will take them. Yeah, they almost took mine. And you won't be able to get them back. <laughs> and then walking back. Running back. Running back. Feels like you're stepping on a bunch of fire ants. <laughs> so. <laughs> Okay, let's go. Yes. <laughs> you never know what to expect on an adventure. We tried our hardest to find it, and I'm sure we will never forget losing Michael's sandal in the dunes and burning his feet running barefoot back to the truck. Today is full of firsts for Michael and I. Next up is Salvation Mountain. Pretty amazing. 28 years. Yeah, I don't care what religion or faith or whatever you are, but what stands out to me here, what this means to me, is love is universal. There's a sign right up front that says love is universal, and that's all that matters to me here. Because that's true. Last up, the Salton Sea. Finding a way to the water, close to where we were, proved to be more difficult than expected. We did find it, eventually. So we reached a dead end and had to stop. It's super smelly here, but Dylan's going to check out to see if there's any water up ahead. We are having a surprisingly difficult time. Finding the Salton Sea. Yes, we are, but there are remains of salt everywhere and some quite disgusting looking water in certain places, yes. Um, so attempt number four. We're on attempt number four. And fourth attempt, we made it to the Salton Sea. As you can see, all the sodium is on top of the sand here, and this water is disgusting. The color is as mucky brown as you can get. Beautiful view of the mountains, but yeah. Yes, gross. Gross. Ah, uh, if we touch it, we'll probably die. Look at all these shells. Down, bring it down to both brands. Okay, here it goes. Ah. Ew. Ah. <laughs> Ew, it smells bad. Okay, let's go. I need hand sanitizer. Yes, we do. Even if we're not using a hose, this is a great time to use the water port. Wash your hands. Come over here. Yeah. 
Ew. Just give it a good water. Get that good bits. Oh, it smells so bad. You guys, like, it literally smells like rotten fish and farm mix. Fish barn. Rotten fish barn. Rotten perfect. fish barn. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Have some, you want some of this, man? Oh, uh, hell yeah. It's about time you offer. Oh. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I'm so happy to have a hand sanitizer in my life. No. Do you need more? I think I, I definitely need more hand sanitizer. That was like a smidget of sanitizer. Thank you. Okay. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, now I can. Oh breathe. man. After being so new to overlanding and missing Expo West 2017, this trip had been anticipated for the whole year leading up to it. It's a bit surreal that it has now come and gone and that we are now finished sharing the experience with you. We hope you enjoyed following this journey. It won't be the last. We still have a lot up our sleeves, so stay tuned for what will be next on Trailbenders Overland. Hope to see you on the trails, and remember that all it takes is to just go. Good to see you, dude. It's been fun. Yeah. Sure. All right. Insert right here again. This will hold the tank in full. Do this. Shit, dude. I just, I just choked on a freaking bug. I that created fire. It's gushy! It's gushy! <laughs> Swimming was a success. Woo. Swimming was a... Dang, Dilly, you blind! Oh! What's your name? I'm Jeremy. Dylan. Yeah, good to see you. Region, Lake Powell, Utah, it's beautiful. Oh, and... Bob was awesome. Yeah. Bob. So we're starting to plan our next trip. Oh, in Africa. Yeah. So I just met uh, Mike and Doug, waiting to find out the winner of the iBot giveaway.